There's a lot of douchebags here. No oh, shit. Yeah. I need to realize that in order to have a sweet party, they just stop inviting a dick line. Hey, bear me. Hey, dick lips. Bear me. Well, we might as well stay here a while. If we give it about an hour or so. All these girls are gonna realize how douchey these dudes are, and they're gonna have to come our way, right? Yeah, you're probably right. Then I'm kind of feeling drunk already. Let's get your pussy. <laughs> that dude looks like he's 40. <laughs> yeah, dude, what is up with that mustache? I don't know, it's like he forgot to shave it when he graduated high school. <laughs> oh, man. That's disgusting. Why is he even talking to her? Yeah, she looks like... She's like way hotter than like he could ever pull off. 2012 high school? Yeah, she probably hasn't even graduated yet. <laughs> she probably, he probably graduated with his, her dad. What's she doing? How is this allowed at this party? <laughs> what are we doing at this party? 23, uh, 25 years old? <laughs> You guys usually this antisocial? Excuse me? Aren't you a little old to be at a house party? Um, what are you talking about? Yeah, who the fuck are you? Lacey Stevens. We went to elementary school together. I moved away sophomore year of high school. Ringing any bells? Mm, no, but were you always this bitchy? Anyway, I was just passing through town and heard about this party and decided to come. I mean, free booze. Might as well. Uh, it's actually five bucks a cup. We brought our own stuff. What do you think of that? <laughs> Had a long drive. Kind of ready for some shots. Why not? <laughs> Shit, I'm done. So, uh, what are we drinking to? Fuck it, let's go. You guys ready to do another one? Fuck it. I'm sitting in the sip So. Get up. I've been out here for hours, I'm freezing, my phone's dead, and I'm not digging through your pockets to look for yours to get me the hell out of here. Well, I don't have anything in my pockets.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Noah's phone. Why the hell do you have Noah's phone? I don't know. You know, I woke up in some pretty weird places before, but this tops it. It's like the hangover, only like way shittier. I don't know what to tell you. I woke up not far from you. And you're sure we didn't do anything? Yes. I don't know, my memory's kind of spotty anyways. Probably all those crappy shots I took last night. Don't blame me for that. That was you taking all that shit. Well, we tend to do that. Do you guys always drink that much? I don't know, it depends. I mean, if I say we drink a lot, then you'll think we're alcoholics. But if I say we don't drink enough, then you're gonna think we're some kind of pussies. I'm not gonna fall for that, so. Whatever. Can I ask you something? Go for it. What'd you move for anyways? My dad got a job out west. Well, because I don't really remember you much. I mean, did you lose weight or something? A little bit. Decided to get a fresh start, new place. So you're a little self-conscious about your image? Well, if you were my height and 20 pounds overweight, what are you? Yeah, probably a good idea. Oh, here's a book you might like, short and fat, just like you. <laughs> How does your fitness aisle? Hey, check it out. Two ass Gorda Punta. <laughs> that means you're fat, bitch. I feel like we've been walking all day. Me too. Why don't we just get this asshole to stop for us? That's rude. Well, I don't know. I'm tired of walking. You guys need some help? Yeah, we're a little lost. Could you possibly give us a lift somewhere to call one of our friends? Yeah, I just live a couple miles down the road if you guys want to call your friends from my house. Hop on in. Piss me off, you fucking jerk. Get on my nerves. How'd you guys end up all the way out here anyways? Well, here comes Johnny with Good his question. His one ball man and he's I have no idea either. Can you turn that crap down? I don't think I'm at the point in my hangover where I can stay in country music. Yeah, things got a little out of control last night. We had a lot to drink. Crazy party, huh? I remember those days. You have no idea. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Troy, nice to meet you guys. Lacey, that's Eric in the back. Hey, uh, do you happen to have a phone with you? The phone I have is kind of dead right now. Yeah, my cell phone doesn't get very good reception out here, but uh, if you guys want to use the one at my house, it'll probably work a little bit better. That's not a problem. We appreciate all the help. No problem. Piss me off, you fucking jerk. Get on my nerves. What are you guys? Don't mind the mess. It's a pretty nice place. Do you live here by yourself? Yep, all by myself. Got a pretty good deal on it, though. Is it scary living out here by yourself? Oh, it's not too bad. I enjoy the peace and quiet. I'd be kind of freaked out, no one around. It's not too bad. The neighbors aren't too far away. I got some Gatorade here in the fridge if you guys want some of that. Always let me know if you want some water. I got some for you. There you go. It'll make you feel a little better. Appreciate it. Mind if I use your water? Yeah, go ahead, man.
Where's my cell phone if you guys need to call anyone? Got some liquids in the fridge if you guys are thirsty and some snacks in the cupboards. Just make yourselves at home. Let me know if you need anything. I'll thank, be back. Thank you so much. Hey, no problem at all. I'm just having some problems with my heater, so I'm going to go work on that. You guys take care. Feel better now? It's a start. Who do you want to call first? Well, we probably can hold off on calling Noah since I have his phone. Here, let me see the phone. I'll call Tyler or my phone. No answer. Call my phone. It's probably somewhere in this house. What do you mean? Shit. What do you mean it's in this house? Don't you recognize this place? This is the house we parted at last night. I wouldn't doubt if Noah and Tyler were lying around or passed out somewhere here. The only thing I don't get is how he doesn't recognize us. There wasn't that many people at the party anyways. Shit. You're right. This place does look kind of familiar. But why wouldn't he say anything when we mentioned we were at a party last night? Who knows? He's probably playing a little joke on us because he knows things got pretty fucked up last night. Wouldn't doubt if those two shitheads took my car and our phones, told Troy about what they were doing, and then ran off before I could even wake up. They pulled crap like this before. It's pretty fucked up. Yeah, it is. But you know what? I'm way too tired to be dealing with this shit right now because I need to use the bathroom. It's probably downstairs. I'm sure you can ask Troy where it is when you get down there. All right, well, if I'm not back in five minutes, Probably taking a dump. fuck with me and then he get the stabs him what the fuck what's going on i don't know dude. untie me shit off. get out of here what the fuck is going on in here what's she doing here she woke up right next to me where's troy he wanted to get something out of his car well why don't you get him untied and then i'll go up and find him said it's upstairs right yeah Remember me now? Fucked with the wrong girl. Finish, Mom. It's not worth the effort. <laughs> <laughs>